thought I'd show you my uh, magic motor. Actually, it's just a good motor demonstration. I pulled apart a little toy motor. This is the inside of it. This is uh, what it looks like. Each one of these little things, there's three little electromagnets on here. You can see it's just a coil of wire and some iron. And they're hooked up to this thing right here. And that acts as a switch which turns these things north-south, north-south as it goes by. And what happens is, uh, first this will be, say, for example, north. And it will be attracted to a south magnet over here. And as it approaches, it, uh, it wants to attract. And then what happens is, because of the way this is arranged, it will become south and this one will become north. So what it does is it first it attracts and then it repels. And then the next one attracts and then it repels. And then this one attracts and then it repels. And it just keeps doing that. And that's all up to the uh, clever engineering of this little piece down here that's causing these to switch. So it's very simple but very powerful little uh, idea to make this thing work. And instead of the casing and the magnets and all that, I made my own. Just take a plastic cup like this and punch a couple holes in it like that. A couple magnets like that. Ordinary old ceramic magnets. I put one inside like this, one inside like that. And then, whoops, slip the armature in there like that. And then we will make it run. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook this these couple double A batteries up here, and instead of the instead of the uh, brushes that you normally see, I'm just going to use the end of the wires and get them here like this. Touch them in there without shorting. And there she goes. You can change the speed by moving the brushes around. Slowing it down. Speeding it up. She's really spinning, but Anyway, this is how it works. Uh, you just have two brushes. I'm directly putting the electricity onto here. And what's happening is the magnets on the uh, armature here are alternating uh, north-south, north-south. And of course the magnet that's stuck on here, this bottom magnet only holds the other magnet in place, otherwise it tries to stick the armature. But anyway, that's uh, all it's doing is uh, these things are alternating north-south, north-south, causing it to attract and then repel from the magnet on the bottom. And by adding power right here, that's how one of these little uh, DC motors works. There's not much to it when you see it inside. Just coils of wire and uh, this special little, if you will, a switch that is turning these things on and off as they go by and making it go north-south, north-south, and then spinning. So. Anyway, that's all there is to it, to one of these little DC motors. Hope you found it interesting.